high PSC. There are a couple of things which I'm excited about, I guess. Tomorrow is Seven Demo's six month anniversary. That's right. We have been doing these vlogs for six months. Now that's commitment. Another thing that I'm excited about is that I found my old glasses. Yep, that's right. I used to wear glasses. Um, not because I had bad eyes or anything. That is because they thought that by giving me glasses, which um, magnified everything slightly, that they could get me to concentrate more, be more here. Because because as a kid, I really wasn't here that much. I was often whoopoo bland. Um, I stopped wearing them in year nine because of headaches and my eyes were start hurting after a long time reading. But um, my eyes still hurt after a long time reading, which isn't good. Um, I I did get my eyes checked, but they said that there was nothing wrong with them. Said maybe they're a bit weak. But besides that, the first gla pro glasses. I found is practically um, one of the oldest. It's a pair I wore like in primary school up to around like year seven, year six, like that. Um, they're this, the things. Um, they just don't fit if I put them on. See, that's how small my head used to be. Quite daunting. And this second pair are quite a wiry pair, as you can see. Um, but they're a hell of a lot smaller, thank god. And yeah, I, I wore them from the time when I got new glasses up to when I stopped wearing glasses. And this, this is what I look like with, um, with glasses. I'm sorry for the glare from the, um, computer screen and the, everything else but yeah as, as a kid um I'd often gone away in like retreats and camps and stuff like that and I'd always be told by perfect strangers kids of course but perfect strangers nonetheless they looks like a female Harry Potter with the glasses they're um they're the, a pair of older girls once time one time who um went as far as to nickname me Harrietta or Harriet. Now I thought I had left behind being being thought of as as a female Harry Potter when I got rid of the glasses. But no. Um a week ago, maybe two, one of my friends, just out of the blue, said For some reason you remind me of a female Harry Potter. I wanted to scream. Not that it's bad being thought as a female Harry Potter, but <laughs> just that, what about my features, either with glasses or without glasses, makes me look like a female Harry, Harry Potter. Reminds people of a female Harry Potter. Reminds me of Harry Potter. Reminds people of Harry Potter. Look, <sighs> I just don't understand. Anyway, us is back on since, I don't know. Another thing I find interesting is how different I look with glasses and without glasses. When I first stopped wearing glasses, it was like, whoa, no glasses. It was weird. It was odd. At first, um, people didn't even realize I stopped wearing glasses because people don't really see a lot. I guess now I can kind of understand how... how Superman thought that that having a pair of glasses was a suitable enough disguise so that so that no one would realize that he wasn't just a, a, a reporter, he was in fact Superman. Although sometimes you still have to wonder why someone didn't work it out. I mean, even though there's difference, there isn't that much difference. You could still recognize me. Couldn't you? Here's my challenge for you guys. Create a vlog or a text comment and tell me what 
famous person or famous literary character, you've been told that you resemble. It, it doesn't just have to be in looks, it can be in personality, hobbies, etc, etc, etc. Because we've all been told that we look like this famous thingy bobby, or we remind them of such and such. I guess it's human nature to find patterns where there are none. I don't know. So PSC, that's my vlog for today. I guess there's no real deep dark undertone or wise messages after that I have to communicate today. Just me marbling up my old glasses. <laughs>